Hello and welcome back to A Swift Look. I'm Zoe Jewell and today we have photos of Taylor and Travis on their Bahamas vacation. It's true people, after, I don't know, a few days of speculating whether or not they were on vacation and then a few days of knowing they were on vacation but not seeing any photographs of the vacation, we now have photographic evidence of Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey on their Bahamas vacation, many photos to be specific. They, I think, were originally published on page six. So if you want to go see all the photos, we'll actually drop the link to the article in the description of this video. So you can go and look at the photos if you haven't seen them while we discuss them. Um, but they're also all over social media. If you are on Swifty social media or that side of, 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 of the internet, you've probably seen these pictures by now um, because they have truly taken the Swifty, the Tavis community by storm. Now, before we get into the photos, I do think it's important to discuss because I've been seeing a lot of conversation about this on the internet. We obviously talked about it. I think it was last week, maybe it was the week before when we got that very grainy photo of Taylor and Travis on the boardwalk. And a lot of people were saying, guys, we should not be talking about this photo. We shouldn't be posting this photo. And now obviously, we have all these photos, these paparazzi photos of Taylor and Travis. And I think there's a lot of people who are trying to figure out what we should and shouldn't share when it comes to Taylor and Travis paparazzi photos and when it's appropriate to discuss these photos and when it's not appropriate to, to discuss these photos or to share these photos on the internet. And here's my perspective. And I think everybody watching this probably has their own perspective too. But I feel like one, I appreciate at least with the pictures that came out this week that they waited to share them until after Taylor and Travis were gone. They're obviously back in Los Angeles. We now know that. So I appreciate that they waited to share the photos until they were no longer there. And I think that's a big reason why people were so protective and didn't want to share the photo that we first got, the, the, the fan photo that I think Dumois posted because they were, it was right when they had got, right, right when they arrived in the Bahamas. And so they were, it felt like, I don't know, people were then going to bother them and be in their personal space while they were actually on vacation. It's a different thing once we know they're not there to then be like, hey, we actually saw Taylor and Travis on vacation, but it, it feels different to kind of blow up their spot and give away their location when they clearly don't necessarily want that out there uh, for everybody to see. I also feel like paparazzi agencies and these photo companies that take these pictures, I'm not saying there's always an understanding between the celebrity and the paparazzi for these photos, but there oftentimes are. Um, and so I, and, and again, we have no idea whether or not Taylor or Travis knew that there was paparazzi taking photos of them. Um, and so I think everybody has to decide for themselves what they're comfortable with, what they're not comfortable with. Obviously we're not sharing the photos on this video here, but the photos are out there. There's nothing that we can do about that now at this point in, in time. So again, if you want to see the photos as we discuss them, put the link in the, in, in the description. But I think it's an interesting conversation to have about when we share paparazzi, when we don't share paparazzi, what we're okay with, what we're not okay with. Um, and I'd be curious to know what you guys think in the comments um, about, especially like, like fans sharing these images. Cause like I said, I've seen these pictures that have just come out all over social media. Um, so clearly it seems like the fan base, at least for the most part is okay with these images. Okay, but let's get to the images um, and you can follow along as I mentioned. So a lot of photos of Taylor and Travis in the water kissing. Taylor's got her little cocktail with her. She was not going to let that go, even getting into the ocean, which I find to be funny. Um, and um, Taylor's wearing this really cute yellow bathing suit. Um, and they just look so happy. They look so in love. They're kissing on the beach. They're laying on the sand. They're relaxing, just enjoying themselves. It also seems like they were maybe like heading towards a boat at one point. Um, I don't exactly know if they got on the boat or not, but they just look like they're having a great time. And there's just something really nice about seeing two people happy and in love and enjoying themselves on, on a vacation, relaxing. It makes me wish I was on a beach vacation right now, honestly. Um, and yeah, I don't know. There's just something very, very sweet about it. And I hope they had a great time. I hope they enjoyed themselves. And again, it's like we didn't, I, I, I know we got a couple of glimpses into Taylor and Joe's 
relationship in the past and like some photos of them on vacations and, and whatnot, but it really felt like for the most part, we got nothing when it came to them. And I do like that Taylor and Travis, they just, they just seem to really enjoy life, plain and simple. And they don't seem to care if people see it, which I think is really, I think it's really cool um, that they just do what they want to do. They enjoy themselves. They have a good time. They don't seem concerned uh, about other people and other people's opinions. And I think that's really refreshing. Um, so I loved seeing these pictures, made me very happy. Um, and I just always love seeing them together. Let me know in the comments what you think and what you thought of the, of the Bahama vacation pictures, uh, your thoughts on the sharing of these images. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.